Hey everyone, welcome and thank you for joining us for another great video here on Chuck Wagon MTG. Today we're doing what's probably one of the uh, final uh, Throne of Eldraine pack cracking sessions for our patrons. Uh, we've got uh, Theros coming up uh, here very shortly. Actually, I think I might have done my math wrong. I think we might have one more Throne pack open. I don't know. We'll see. I don't plan ahead. It's not my thing. Anyway, let's go ahead and jump right into it. Um, first off, who do we have? We have Mr. Joel Sudno Husky. Joel, thank you so much for being a patron. It's greatly appreciated. Um, now, I've got our packs here, and I almost forgot about doing this. Um, I've seen MTG Unpacked do this a whole bunch. So here's all the packs we're, we're opening today. And then we're going to bless these. Uh, now, I don't have any uh, Planeswalker pop vinyls that are out of the package so we are going to use uh my friend the, the the rabbit from from monty python uh i've had him for quite some time he actually you can notice he's got a little stick in his mouth and that's because he's uh become so old that the spring that keeps his mouth open is starting to poke out his butt so but anyways uh we're going to have him uh he's going to bless these packs bless 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 uh with the blessing of the holy hand grenade uh, and hopefully that works. I don't know, like I said, MTG Unpacked does it all the time, and it seems to work out for him, so we'll go ahead and take those. We're going to throw those back over here, and then we're going to grab two for Joel, said the Husky, and then we're going to build him a pack out of our Build-A-Pack box. We've got one rare. We've got two rares. Common or uncommon, worth at least a buck. These are starting to get pretty slim pickings, but it's getting filled after this video, because this is the last video for the month uh, for patrons, so all the cards that we've opened this month for the build pack box now get to go in them so uh anyways that was a random foil and a random foil basic um if you're curious about knowing more about our patreon look down in the description of this video you can find a link to our patreon page where you'll find all the the good stuff there you'll see what i'm doing here is i'm actually uh these are the commons and uncommons throughout magic's history he gets 10 of these as well there's also some random foils thrown in random rares uh prize cards which actually we haven't seen a prize card in a while um so we're, we're long overdue we got one two three four five six seven eight nine i tried to shorten you joel i'm sorry well great you know what because of that you're gonna get this one and the very last card in the box you're getting a bonus because uh, i tried to shorten you there so anyways all this for 10 bucks that's pretty awesome stuff all right let's see what we got for Joel, a lot of the common stuff. We got a Sandblast. We got a Pulsa Marasa, uh, Totally Lost. Thraben Foulbloods. Uh, we got a Justice Strike. Uh, Crossing Druid. Uncaged Fury. This is such a good card. Man, I love that card. We got a Prized Griffin. We got a Short Sword. Uh, Enchanted Carriage. Conclave Guild Mage. Uh, Crossing Tusker is the final card all right let's see what we got for your random foil basic it is a dominaria island that's kind of kind of sexy there our random foil is a samala wood shaver and then our common or uncommon worth at least a buck we have got ooh fish liver oil um yeah i haven't checked out this price in a long time i'll double check i'll see where it's at but i'm pretty sure that's still over a buck um yeah, so, all right, let's see what we got for our rares. Our first rare is a Dark Salvation. That's fun times. And then our second rare is a Biomancer's Familiar. All right, no idea where the price is on those, but uh, let's go ahead and see what we get in your packs. I mean, the fish liver oil is kind of nice. That is from uh, the original... Um, uh, drawn a complete blank um arabian nights wow all right let's go ahead and see what joel got in his packs holy cats all right hey we got claim the firstborn just did a deck tech on this one last week such a fun deck check it out uh we got righteousness red cat melee and then our rare is ooh, a torbran thrain of red fell and then we got a foil as well. Let's go ahead and see what our foil is. Our foil is, hey, a foil happily ever after. Um, 
I mean, it's a foil rare. That's nice. <laughs> Excuse me, folks. Um, but it is happily, happily ever after. Um, you know what? And, and just because I'm throwing that in too, and then you can start your uh, own construction on uh, Goblin Adoption Agency if you so choose. Plus, I've got a lot of... I mean, I bought a bunch of copies of this when I first saw it spoiled just because I loved it so much. Uh, I got foils and whatnot. So, um, I I have enough. I don't need more. We got another foil. Holy cats. All right, we got uh, Revenge of the Ravens. There's another... I got another deck tech uh, that runs that. That's good stuff, man. Good stuff. We got Spinning Wheel. We got Arcanus Owl. And then a Sorcerer's Spyglass. That's not a bad card. It really isn't. I'm... Okay, so there there seems to be this debate that I keep saying about people going back and forth between it being good. This card is only good if you're familiar with the meta. If if you're going into a meta that you don't know anything about, this card isn't going to do you a whole lot of good. Um, sideboard, you know, if you have a good enough memory, I guess. But this, this card kind of does require some knowledge about the other deck for it to properly be used uh and then let's go ahead and see what our foil is our foil is uh a mist ford river turtle all right foil in each pack that's not too shabby all right well there you are congratulations joel we'll go ahead and take your cards here put them in the stack. and then go ahead and put these up here all right who do we got next next up we have uh, MTG Hermit. MTG Hermit, thank you so much for being a patron. Greatly appreciated. We're going to do the same thing because he's in the same tier. Two rares. Common run, common worth at least a buck. Random foil. We'll grab the first one and we'll grab the last uh, foil land. And then 10 out of here and hopefully hit a dang prize card. Um, I don't think we've ever gone an entire month well i mean like last month was the first month i think that we went without hitting a prize card and we still haven't hit one so i don't know what's going on here i don't see we got one two three four five six seven eight nine and ten all right let's go ahead and see what we got for mtg hermit which if you get a chance go ahead and check out his channel he's got some good stuff we got a Senate Guild Mage. Uh, we've got a Blinding Drone, War Priest of Thune, uh, Bartered Cow, Smitten Swordmaster. Uh, we've got a Lava Kim Brawler, uh, Woodland Champion, uh, Rubble Belt Recluse, Sorcerer's Broom, and a Cloud Skin, Cloud Kin Seer. There we go. All right, your foil basic is a Dominaria Mountain, or yeah, it's a mountain, Dominaria Mountain, the white kind. <sighs> your random foil is an aether toe with your common run coming being uh tamer Sabertooth. once again i'll check but I, I i i'm pretty sure that guy's still over a buck that's a damn good card uh first rare is we got a grave betrayal edh loves this all right what do we got for our last one it is a scheming symmetry this is another one that, man, it didn't see a whole lot of love, but I love this card. Good stuff. All right. Well, congrats on that. Let's see what you got in your packs. Do, 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 do. There we go. All right. I got a Steel Claw Lance. We've got a Fairy Vandal, Rampart Smasher, and then Escape to the Wilds. All right, next pack. All right, we got a Clockwork Servant. We've got a Rally for the Throne. We've got a Sir Farron the Henchhammer, and then Doom Foretold. Oh well, I said interesting card here. Um, I'm not a huge fan, but I have seen some interesting builds with it. Um, off the top of my head, I don't think we got there this month, Joel. Or, uh, I'm sorry, not Joel. I'm looking at the, the Joel 
the name tag in front of me. Uh, MTG Hermit. Uh, I, I don't think we got there. I apologize. Um, and we may have, but I, I don't think we But, oh. Let's do that. That's bad for cards. So sorry, folks. My, my kids brought home this plague, and I just I can't shake it. It has gotten a hold of me, and holy cats! So, anyways, uh, thank you for being a patron. Greatly appreciate it. Let's see who we got next. Next up, we have Mister Kevin Wheeler. Kevin, thank you so much for being a patron. It is greatly appreciated. Uh, we're gonna do the same thing because this is the most popular tier. Got that. That that yeah we're getting real slim here but like i said we got a lot of cards going in uh into this here um I'm trying to think of the order of the videos i'm pretty sure i'm almost positive by the time this video comes out uh you will have seen our christmas special uh in our christmas special we open up a lot of good stuff for patrons so uh, one two three four five six seven eight nine one more we'll grab number ten uh yeah so if that video hasn't aired uh consider it's a spoiler and if it has go check it out and you can see all the cool stuff that uh that we're putting into the um the box for this next month uh all right let's see what we got for kevin we got a talons of the wild or of wildwood harsh sustenance got a master splicer uh, Ancestral Blade, Moonlight Geist, Gruel Beastmaster, got a Crypt Incursion, uh, Makindi Slide Runner, that was a mouthful, uh, we got Manacles of Decay, and then a Barkhide Troll. Good stuff there. Random Foil Basic is, ooh, winner, winner, chicken dinner, you got yourself a 7th edition Foil Planes. It's been a while since we've seen one of the older ones, too. All right, Random Foil is a rank officer from uh, one of the modern sets. Uh, is that Horizons? Yeah, I think so. All right, common run, common worth, least a buck. Ashok, Dream Renderer. Um, I'll double check, but that's still a good card, no matter how you cut it. First rare is uh, you got a Magmaw from um, Rise, Rise of the Eldrazi. Uh, second rare is Castle Embreth. Looks like you're playing red. All right, well, congratulations on that. Let's go ahead and get our packs and see what's in them, see if those blessings took hold uh, from the last couple packs. I don't think they did. Maybe it's because I used a killer bunny. I, I don't know. All right, we got a Sir Car of the Bold. Frogify. Uh... Grumgully, the generous, and then our rare is a wildborn preserver. That that's a good card. And then limited broken. Limited is so good, so so good. I I, I apologize, but it's gonna happen again. Three videos in a row now. I've had to take a cough drop while doing the video. I don't know, folks. I ain't got no excuse. All right, let's see what that next pack is anything good so i'm just curious what are you guys excited about for the return of theros i know i had a lot of fun during that block so good stuff uh glass casket we got a flaxen intruder okay so yeah my autofocus is not on and i'm not going to mess with it right now but if y'all get a chance check out the detail like look at a a high-res image of this card that is the scariest little girl you ever seen because you can't see it very well here on this camera but the look on her face she is a sociopath I don't care what you tell me that girl kills people like a lot of people triple digits scary All right, and then we got a Sir Allen uh, the lion's claw with our rare being a witch's vengeance that's a good one that i am starting to really dislike uh, um, i've played that quite a few times uh, or played that quite a few times. Also, I'm just getting uh, 
lately I've been playing a lot of uh, weenie decks. You know, a lot of 1-1s, one 1-2s, one things like that. And this just destroys me. So, anyways, there you are, Kevin. Thank you very much for being a patron. It is greatly appreciated. All right. Who do we have up next? Oh, next up we have MTG Unpacked. Um, now, thank you very much for being a patron. And I want to show you guys something that the mat, you noticed uh, for the longest time, I've always used the Art of MTG playmat that came with that uh, magic art show. Um, but I've switched up the last couple of weeks. This one in particular, this Vivian Reed mat, is actually going out to MTG Unpacked uh, with the with these cards here. Uh, he won last month's uh, Patreon, patron only giveaway. And uh, this is the prize he chose out of our out of our um, box of goodies, I guess. And then just so you can see, because I don't know if there's different versions of this, but this is the Detroit Grand Prix uh, version of this mat. So, all right. Well, let's go ahead and grab him. We got two packs. And then same thing with that extremely popular tier. We got one. We got two. We got that. We got that. And we got that. And then we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. All right. Let's see what we have in here for MTG Unpacked, aside from this beautiful Vivian Reed playmat. Uh, he's got a Sorcerer of the Fang. Got a Negate. Uh, Bone Splinters. I probably should get back in center here. Uh, we've got a Vile Rebirth. Uh, Voracious Vampire. Unsummon. Uh, we've got a Knight of the Tusk. Uh, Dwarven Priest. Vampire of the Dire Moon. And Dega Disciple. Interesting. All right. Let's see what we got here. Your foil basic is... <laughs> Once again, sorry, folks. <laughs> All right, we got an M20 Island, followed by your random foil, which is a Sangrite Backlash. That's uh, from Alara. That's that's actually a pretty looking foil. All right, our common or uncommon is... Oh, Icar Clomer. Love this guy. Uh, first rare is... Uh, Epiphany at the Drown Yard, followed by Psy, Master Thopterist. That dude's fun stuff right there. Fun, fun stuff. All right, let's see what you got in your packs. I think your uh, the build a pack box pack turned out rather well. So let's see if we can carry on some of that luck. Did we get a foil? I don't think we did. We got a Steel Claw Lance, uh, Shambling Suit, Slaying Fire, and then we did get a foil. We got an Iron Crag Feet. All right. And then the foil we got is a Mara Leaf Rider. All right. Good stuff. And still no prize cards in any of the build. I'm going to have to, I don't know. Maybe I got to add more or something. I'll figure it out. All right, we got an Ember, Embereth Shield Breaker. Uh, giant Opportunity, Joust, and then your rare is Fervent Champion. That's not bad. That's a, a nice, a 1-1 one, one with haste for one is very acceptable. The giving him first strike, even better. And the fact that he can, uh, he can pump stuff. Yeah. And then... It's, it's just, there's, there's a good card. All right. Well, there you are. If I can get your cards together, we'll do that. I'm going to thank you again for being a patron because it is greatly appreciated. Couldn't do any of this stuff without you guys. Um, yeah, without you guys, I, I wouldn't stand a chance in this. So, All right, who do we have up next? Next up, we have Richard Foreman. Thank you so much for being a patron. It is greatly appreciated. Same thing. Two packs. We got one. We got... We're going to grab that very last one. Two. Common or uncommon. 
foil. Random foil basic. And then 10 of these bad boys. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, grab two. Eight, nine, and 10. But we only counted as one. That's just one of the things we do. I don't know why we do that. We just do. All right. We got a gift of paradise. We got naturalize, uncage fury, uh, dawn strike paladin. We got a trusted Pegasus, garrison sergeant, uh, macabre waltz, uh, ab abstruse, in abstruse interference. Okay. Uh, we got an Alcum uh, Flame Seeker, Akum, Alcum, I don't know. We got a uh, Vizcopa Vampire and a Yarox Fen Lurker. Foil Basic is uh, a uh, Innistrad Swamp. That's twice today. Mountain. Random Foil is, ooh, a Crush from, uh, is that Meriden Besieged? And then, let's see what we got. Oh, not that. We got a Psychic Corrosion. Um, I'll double check with this being rotated. I don't think the price is still there. Uh, if it's not, we'll replace it. All right, our first rare is a Finale of Eternity. So you got yourself a Mythic. That's not too shabby. Followed by a Palaka Worm. All right, everyone's favorite giant worm. Well, congratulations on that. Let's see what we got in your packs. Oh, I think we, we got a foil back there. I got a glimpse. All right, we got an animating fairy, uh, inquisitive puppet, ferocity of the wilds, and a Yorvo, Lord of Garenbrig. With our foil being, I hope it is what I think it is. It is not, but it's still a glass casket. That's not a bad foil to pull. Not too shabby. When when I saw the white artifact, I was thinking the uh, oh, what is the white mythic one? I forget. It's a card. Uh, we got an elite headhunter. Uh, we've got an animating fairy. We've got mysterious pathlighter, and then. Hushbringer, one of the creepiest starts in all of Magic. This card creeps me out. I don't know why. It just, it does. Anyways, those are your pulls. Thank you so much for being a patron. It is greatly appreciated. Go ahead. And then, let's see what we got. Next, who do we have next? We have Twilight. Twilight, thank you so much for being a patron. It is greatly appreciated. I'm going to do the same thing here. Two packs. One. Two rares. Common or uncommon. Got yourself a foil. And foil basic. And then we go one, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Man, let's hope there is a prize card in here because two months of no prize cards, um, I gotta change something. All right, we got a Sorcerer of the Fang. We've got a Kozlux Pathfinder, Sh uh, Shine Chaser. We've got a Disfigure. Whirlwind Adept, Goblin Assailant, we've got Shimmer of Possibilities, uh, we got Goblin Legionnaire, we got Prized Elephant, and Winged Words, or Winged, if that's how you choose to pronounce it. Our foil basic is, ooh, a Shadowmoor Swamp. That, that is Shadowmoor, right? I think it is, yeah. All right, good hit on that. Uh, let's see. Regular foil is... Ooh, you got a foil rare. A Melitus Charlatan. All right. Is that a promo? No, it's not a promo. All right. Common or uncommon. Uh, I got a cast down. I'm 
almost positive this is not um, over a buck anymore. Uh, in fact, I'm pretty sure we ran into one of these last week, so we'll go ahead and swap that out for you. First rare is a Knight of Autumn, followed by hey, a Celestial Colonnade. That's not too shabby. Good stuff. All right, congratulations. Let's see what's in your packs. Sorry, folks. I'm trying to, like, choke them back, but it just doesn't work that way. All right, we got an Elite Headhunter, Clockwork Servant, Kenrith, Transformation, with your first rare being... Oh, Sworn Knight. That's not a bad one. That's the Black Knight for Manny, Monty Python, for anyone that didn't know. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, look it up. It's spot on. All right, let's see what this is in this last pack. I believe we have a foil. We've got a Wandermare. We've got a Ferocity of the Wilds. Rampart Smasher and a Stone Coil Serpent. This is good stuff right here. All right, let's see what we got as our foil. It is... Oh, you got yourself uh, another foil uh, land. You got a foil forest. All right. Well, good stuff there. I think uh, all right. Who do we have next? Uh, we're churning through them today. Today, next, we have Mr. Cody Halat. Cody, thank you so much for being a patron. Uh, now, he is in our booster pack club, which means uh, he for four bucks, he gets us a pack of cards and a random foil basic. And as you've seen, we've got some old ones in here, too, so... Not too bad, if you ask me. His foil basic is a uh, return to return to return uh, planes. And let's go ahead and see what Cody got in his pack. Do do do. Uh, we got Shepherd of the Flock. We got a Windermore Commander. We got a Mysterious Pathlighter and Fires of Invention. As long as this doesn't get the Banhammer, man, I love this card such good stuff such good stuff all right well congratulations on that cody go ahead and stick your name on that all right and then who do we have next last but certainly not least mr kevin Chan. kevin thank you so much for being a patron it's greatly appreciated kevin is actually a good friend of mine and our oldest patron so let's see what Kevin is going to get. We're going to pick him a random foil basic, which is, excuse me, an M20 Island. And let's see if he has the luck in the pack. Kevin's been kind of lucky with some of our, uh, some of his pulls that he's had uh, over his time as a patron. Uh, but that's probably because there was like three months that he was, the first three months he was a patron, we weren't actually doing Patreon. We simply set it up, um, and he became a patron. So for like three months, uh, I think he was, at, he was at like the dollar tier or whatever, but like he didn't actually get anything. And I, I told that Kevin, I'm like, hey, this is what's going on. You know, you're signed up, and while we appreciate it, we have nothing to give. And he's like, no, it's cool. Just go ahead and keep it. Just, you know, do your thing. So Kevin's a good dude. <laughs> we got Wander Mare, Inspiring Veteran, Sage of the Falls, followed by, <laughs> hey, winner, winner, chicken dinner. A, the Royal Scions, the first dual Planeswalker Planeswalker card. That is some good stuff right there. Well, congratulations, Kevin. That's some good stuff. Go ahead and grab your name tag. Oh, and put it up here. All right. Now we got one pack left. What are we going to do with this? Well, for those of you who are familiar with these videos, this is the time of the video that we go over. We First of all, we got to flip the camera. Um, over to Wheel Decide. I absolutely love this site. And essentially, what you do is you simply comment on a video. That's it. Um, these are all the names of the people who commented from one of last week's videos. I did technically include a, a video that was from the week before. Um, it didn't get put out till Sunday, so it didn't have the same amount of views as it normally would. So I included that Sunday video as well but anyways all your names are in here we're gonna run over to random.org we're gonna roll two six-sided dice whatever comes up that's how many times we're gonna click the wheel 
Uh, and we have got six. We're going to click the wheel six times. Whoever it lands on, you're going to win uh, the rare or mythic and or foil that's in this pack. Uh, so good luck to everyone that's involved. We got once, twice, thrice, four, five, and six. Congratulations to... Hey, look at that. We got Richard Corwin. So let's go ahead and throw these in with your packs. Excuse me. Now, had uh, the person who won not been a Patreon member, um, the rules for this are simple. You simply comment in a video to be entered. To win, you have to be subscribed to the channel, and then you have to contact us with your mailing information. Uh, if you don't do that, we can't get you your cards, and then after 30 days, they actually go into the build the pack box that you see me pulling out of in this video. All right, let's go ahead and skip past all this stuff. Did we get a... F no, we didn't. I'm sorry. All right, we got a uh, Tournament Grounds. We got a Deathless Knight. Uh, Sir Eleonora the Discerning, followed by... Hey, Castle Vantress. That, that's not a bad one. That's not a bad one. So I'll go ahead and I'll stick those in uh, with your other pulls from today. And I think that's... Yeah, that's about it. All right. Well, um, I hope everyone had a wonderful holiday uh, and a Merry Christmas uh, from everyone here at Chuck Wagon MTG. We desperately want to wish you a Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays. Um, and just, you know, thank you. Thank you for the support we've seen, uh, especially over this last year or so, uh, has been really strong. And uh, I'm just, I'm very thankful for each and every one of you. So, uh, yeah, if you like what you saw here today, do us a huge favor. Click the like button, hit subscribe, hit the bells notification button so you can tell we have new stuff coming out, and then share this. Share it with your friends, your family, your loved ones, and your pets. Everyone could use a little more magic in their lives. Once again, thank you very much for watching. As always, you can find us on all the social medias, Chuckwagon MTG.